we greet our dear andunulapam readers in the mighty name of the lord jesus it's 24th of june the monday year 2024 today let's meditate on the topic the almighty and the alpha and the omega the beginning and the end says the lord who is and who was and who is to come the almighty for the book of revelation chapter 1 verse 8 who's the god we believe in what is our dear lord like and here are four important revelations in this regard firstly he is and was and is to come secondly he is the almighty god thirdly he is the alpha and the omega and fourthly he is the beginning and the end a diamond has many facets when the diamond is held up to bright light each facet will reflect differently similarly god has many names and each of that expresses his nature and character lord has approximately 272 names an important name among them is almighty god god has dominion and authority over everything he is great in his might almighty god is refer to us el shaddai in hebrew when the lord appeared to abraham he said i am almighty god walk before me and be blameless for the book of genesis chapter 17 verse 1 the name jehovah sabaoth also has the same meaning it means the one who leads all the armies in heaven and on earth we praise and worship the lord by singing the god almighty is mine and he that conquered death has become my life almighty god bestows a portion of his infinite power upon us his children i'll be a father to you and you shall be my sons and daughters says the lord almighty to the book of 2 corinthians chapter 6 verse 18 use the power that the almighty has granted you the lord says behold i give you the authority to trample on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy and nothing shall by any means hurt you to the book of luke chapter 10 verse 19 so you do not have to fear any power of darkness or the devil on that day the kings of rome showed themselves to be very powerful they conquered most of the world and they showed themselves to be like gods but if we look at the end of those kings we see that most of them became mentally deranged and mad while they had power when they reigned they did not have omnipotence christians were regarded lowly in the roman empire yet god almighty protected them saying do not fear little flock children of god even today he reigns as the king of kings as the almighty god verse for for the meditation from the book of job chapter 37 verse 23 as for the almighty we cannot find him he is excellent in power in judgment and abundant justice he does not oppress today's bible reading meditation for morning from the book of job chapter 1 and chapter 2 Bible reading for the evening from the book of Acts chapter 7 verses 22 to 43